Goal setting with small, achievable goals can help set you up for success by providing a clear path and direction for your efforts. By setting specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound SMART goals, you can identify areas where you want to improve and create a plan for how to get there. This can help you stay focused and motivated and track your progress as you work towards your goals. Setting small achievable goals also has several advantages. First, it can help you build confidence and a sense of accomplishment as you achieve each goal. This can provide a boost of motivation and encourage you to keep going. Second, it can help prevent you from becoming overwhelmed or discouraged as you can focus on achieving each small goal without worrying about the larger long-term goal. Finally, it can help you stay flexible and adaptable as you can adjust your goals and plan as needed based on your progress and any changes that come up. Overall, setting small achievable goals can provide a clear plan and direction for your efforts, help you stay motivated and on track, and set you up for success as you work towards your goals. So today, we're going to discuss goal setting and following through with action for improving English communication skills as an L2 English speaker. If you're ready, let's get into it. If you want to improve your English communication skills as an L2 English speaker, there are a few things you can do to set goals and follow through with action. First, identify areas where you feel you need the most improvement. This could be grammar, vocabulary, pronunciation, or something else. Once you have identified these areas, set specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound SMART goals for yourself. For example, you could set a goal to improve your grammar by studying for 30 minutes a day or to expand your vocabulary by learning 10 new words a week. Next, create a plan for achieving your goals. This might include finding resources or tools to help you such as grammar books or language learning apps, and setting aside dedicated time each day to focus on your studies. You could also consider joining a language learning group or community. You can join my community. You can also find a language exchange partner to practice communication skills with. It's also important to be consistent and persistent in your efforts. Learning a new language takes time and dedication, so make sure you stick with it and don't be discouraged if you don't see immediate improvements. Finally, track your progress and celebrate your accomplishments along the way. This can help keep you motivated and give you a sense of achievement as you work towards your goals. Let me share a few examples of what a plan for achieving your goals might look like. So first, you want to identify specific resources or tools to help you improve in the areas you need the most help, such as grammar books, language learning apps or textbooks, websites with practice exercises, my own community, Exploring Academy, which you are welcome to join. And then you want to set aside some dedicated time each day to focus on your studies, such as 30 minutes a day or an hour on the weekend. Join a language learning group. You can join my community, like I said. And that way you get a lot of opportunities to have social interaction and practice on a regular basis. This can help provide accountability and motivation to keep up with your studies and making improvements. Set small achievable goals for yourself, such as learning 10 new words a week or completing a certain number of practice exercises each day or reading 20 minutes of your favorite book. 
track your progress and celebrate your accomplishments along the way, such as reaching a certain level in a language learning app or successfully using a new word or idiom in conversation. Remember, the key is to create a plan that works for you and fits with your schedule and learning style. What works for one person may not necessarily work for another. So experiment and find what works best for you. So some other examples of small achievable goals for improving your English communication skills might include completing a certain number of practice exercises each day, such as 10 grammar questions or 20 vocabulary flashcards, learning a set number of new words each week, such as 10 or 15, practicing pronunciation for a certain amount of time each day, such as 10 or 15 minutes, having a conversation in English with a language exchange partner or someone in my community, or it could be a friend, for any amount of time, such as 20 minutes or 30 minutes, it's up to you, reading a certain number of pages in an English book or an article each day, such as 10 or 15 pages. Remember, the key is to set goals that are SMART. They're specific, they're measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. This will help ensure that you can track your progress and celebrate your accomplishments as you work towards your goals. So you might be asking, why is goal setting important? Well, goal setting is important for a number of reasons. First, it helps you identify specific areas where you want to improve, which can help you focus your efforts and make the most of your time and resources. Second, it gives you a sense of direction and motivation as you have a clear target to work towards and a plan for how to get there. Third, it allows you to track your progress and celebrate your accomplishments along the way, which can help keep you motivated and engaged. Finally, it can help you stay accountable to yourself and others as you have committed to achieving specific goals and can be held accountable for your progress. Overall, goal setting can help you stay focused, motivated, and on track as you work towards your goals. In conclusion, goal setting with small, achievable goals can be an effective way to set yourself up for success. By identifying specific areas where you want to improve and creating a plan for achieving your goals, you can stay focused, motivated, and on track as you work towards those goals. Setting small, achievable goals also has several advantages, such as building confidence, preventing overwhelm, and staying flexible and adaptable. Overall, goal setting with small, achievable goals can be an effective way to set yourself up for success and make progress towards your goals. All right, Advanced English Learners, thank you so much for joining me for this lesson. If you enjoyed the lesson, show it some love on the podcast, on the YouTube channel, and of course, on our website. And you can share all of our resources and our website with anyone who wants to improve their English language communication and reach social fluency. All right, see you in the next one. Bye for now. Something very big is going live in January. If you've enjoyed the content we've put out on advanced English and Explearning, then you're going to love what is coming next. If you've wanted an opportunity to meet your fellow Explearners in a welcoming and dynamic environment, then what we have on the horizon is going to be perfect for you. So keep an eye out for more details coming soon and make sure you're subscribed to our newsletter, which you can find on advancedenglish.co and explearning.co because that's where you're going to hear it first. All right. See you then.